Okay, guys. Alfred. <laughs> Just saw the little piece <laughs> off. There we go. He's down. He's down. <laughs> That's worth it. <sighs> I gotta learn to forgive myself. Breadcrumbs. Where are we going? There we go. You smell nice. I think it's you. No, it's you. It might also be the candle you've lit. Possible. Hey, guys. How do you like his new beard? Oh, yeah. Sarah, because she's a huge, huge super simp. Cut my hair like Dante from the Devil May Cry series. Specifically Devil May Cry 5. And then lied and said, no, it wasn't like DMC Dante. It was... I just did it because lots of people have that. Listen up. I've gone over the MedSci report. These things are biorecombinators. She says that like it's a real thing that you would ex expect people to know. It looks really good. Really handsome. Mm -hmm. Look at that. And the hair, and the... You're just so pretty. And that body tissue we keep seeing on the walls is part of it, too. I found a report that This way. It's a habitat changer. Thank you, person who did that with their last dying breath. Would you trust a sign drawn in blood? Uh... Fuck yeah, it worked for me every single time in a video game. So, uh, the reason that I keep going every time that we see a save is because 2, 3, 4 are right there. And we can actually see the names of the chapters there. Oh, that's what you were... I thought you were just trying to make sure I uh, could go back if I needed to. Uh, I, I am... Hey, everyone. Brains behind the that's muscle. That's him. <laughs> I might cry. That really scared me. And if you'll look to your left... A bench. Our good friend, Bench. Thank you, Bench Kun. Sure. So remember, you got the ripper out. Do you, do you hear it? Do you uh -huh. hear his heartbeat? I hear some guys. Might be a brute, considering that they've got an arena for you, and they want to show you their new guy. Okay. Okay. Will he purposely avoid those? Uh, some of them do. Some of them are not smart, though. There they are. Hey, you dirty hoes. Careful now. Come and fight me. Come over here and fight us. Come over here. Um, so the Ripper gets a little bit away from you. Oh, they're the green ones. Pop it. Get in. And you can also move it up and yeah. down. Get more stuff off of them. Ah, uh, sorry. It's okay. It's a new weapon still, and these guys are upgraded. Is he smacking me with another guy? No, there's a thing stuck to him. <sighs> On your right. Bad move. So you don't need to get totally all up in them. Fourth death, that's okay. Let's stop counting. <laughs> If you don't mind. If you don't mind. My balls are exposed. Hello? Monsters? So the Ripper it might be good to get away from them. And now that you've upgraded the Plasma Cutter enough... Oh, there's a guy stuck to his arm. You're right. So even with your upgraded Plasma Cutter, it still takes two shots to cut through the limb on these guys. Because their flesh has been compressed and is a lot tougher. That was one more Another shot. One. Yep, good. Focus on one leg. Arm off. Can you kinesis him? Oh, thanks. Thanks. Yes. We're good. Ah! Don't Put panic. Some tentacles. There you go. Great. Now go step on him. Perfect. Outstanding. I'm just going to do a little once over over here. Because the second you push the button, something will happen. Obviously. Obviously. I hate saying that because that makes me like... It's so metagaming. But... It, 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 is, it is metagaming in the highest degree. Like, there is nothing that you can call that besides metagaming. I don't, I don't, I don't think it's obvious, but... 
Um, it, it's kind of like a word. It's kind of like a sentence filler at this point, I think. <laughs> and the thing that might happen might just be, well, there you go. It might just be a, a dialogue thing. I was literally going to say the, the thing that might happen might just be dialogue, but like, do you hear it? It's going to be something. Oh, in the distance. Now, how many do you think there are? One of them just got hung up. Get away, get away. Oh, you bastard. So those guys was It's an infector! What does that mean? The t t flying guys who infect corpses. So, uh, what do I do? Uh, uh kill it, but good. Uh, uh. Yep, him. He's a good victim of the Ripper, if that interests you, but it looks like he's dead. I don't know if that's the only one, so be careful. There might be more Necros in here than you thought. One guy just stepped in it. I'm going to have to backtrack to get that goodie, so I'm just going to do it now. And I am trying to be very careful, because... I really don't want to have to do this whole sequence again. But, I mean, this Remember game... Remember to look up as well? Because the thing that you want might be stuck on the ceiling. Interesting. ring a ding, -ding. Oh. Yeah, because of the gravity. Excuse me. <clears throat> All we've eaten today is fast food. I'm sick, and Sarah was like, it'll help you. And I was like, you know what? It will. And it did. <sighs> Sometimes just some greasy... Fast food coats your stomach so nicely. And Sarah will quote the pseudoscience and say that the grease will coat your stomach and inure you to things like vomiting. Yeah. I think that the, the, the comfort of it is what does it. I think it's all psychosomatic. No, it coats your tummy. I love pseudo science sometimes. I love that you call it pseudo instead of pseudo. Damn it. Ooh, power lock. Let me just make sure I'm... What did I just pick up those things? Yep. I was trying to reload. On one hand, I'm very grateful that um things don't just go away when you drop them like in other games. Yeah. But on the other. Hmm. The hell is this room? Text log. Well, now I can't cut the whole thing out. Initial infection vectors. It's been less than an hour, but they've spread fast. Flight deck was the first to go after the shuttle crashed. Now almost entirely overrun. We've lost at least half the med deck and a quarter of engineering. No information about cargo or planet operations, which suggests bad news. This is not what I expected. It's so nice to be here playing with you. While I was gone over the summer, it was really fun Sarah, playing. you just looked at those and didn't what? pick them up. Do you have room I for them? I can't. I don't have room. Okay, cool. Uh, Pardon my stern tone. No, it's okay. Uh, wow, we have to come back. But I appreciate it, mm -hmm. my sweet boy. But it's really nice to be in person. Uh, oh, God, we have to go back. Um, it's good to be in person. So many goodies. To play games. Especially since when I was uh, long distance, it sounded like I was recording on a toaster. Well, you can actually see um, this is the mic that I have, and it's what I, this is the one I use for streaming. Sarah, show them your mic. Yeah, it's this piece of shit. So. <laughs> I mean, they're decent headphones, but the mic quality uh, it leaves a little... Leaves a little, uh, leaves a little to be desired. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Leaves a lot to be desired. Uh, level three? Uh, I think two is where we want. Oh, do you hear that? He's having... He's having uh, everywhere at the end of time moments. Oh, man. You know, I was considering making a video about that album. Very interesting. Uh, let it be known that I used to have a terrible fear of getting dementia when I was older. I, uh, I mean, when, wasn't it when you were younger? When I was younger, about getting dementia when I was when, older. Oh, yeah, of course. Oh, shit, I forgot we picked that up. Okay. Um, so let's take a look at that contact beam, huh? Yeah. Uh, High damage energy projector. So contact beam. We're, we're playing this the way Sarah wants, by the way. So fuck you guys if you want us to just get on with it. No. Look. 
this is what I would do. I would do it as granular and safe as possible. And granted, part of that would be because I'm doing it on Zealot. I'm playing Dead Space 2 on Zealot, and I'm using everything that I can to get ahead of the game. I mean, this goes along with that thing of, like... I don't know. I want to hear you guys. Uh, like, if anybody has any opinions to offer, I would love to hear it. What's your favorite gun? What do you think is the most objectively good to use? Um, uh, Unless you think it's the plasma cutter. I've heard a lot about how the plasma cutter is great. Well, I mean, maybe someone has a new opinion, so... <laughs> I'm always up to I'm hear kidding. it. Hmm, did I save? So, by the way, the first chapter is called New Arrivals. In case you want to look at that and see the names of the chapters. So it's new arrivals, intensive care, course correction, and obliteration imminent. So we got... Wait, where's chapter one? Well, we don't have a save from chapter one. Oh. Uh, because we start it... Chapter one, we can just start the whole game over. So I don't need a save at the start of it. So what's chapter one's name? New arrivals. So new arrivals in I C. I don't know. Okay. Nothing from NICO? Nicholas? Nikolai? I'm, I'm going to blow a piece of my skull out through my head. My brain's going to explode and a chunk of my skull... Am I close? This big is just going to go... Whoosh, Am I close? Off to the side. Uh, yeah, kind of. Uh, Nicole? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, his wife. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> of course, it must be Nicholas. <laughs> who is Nicholas? I will find out. I must know. As soon as I find out who Nicholas is, I will have cracked the code of Dead Space 1. I love that song you use for... Um... You, uh, you got turned yep, completely Yep, yep, yep. I like that song you use to... Time Lapse? Time Lapse. It's the little... Uh, that song is Smoking Roll from God Hand. Uh, God Hand is uh, possibly the greatest game of all time if you haven't played it. Uh, if you haven't played it, play it. The greatest unplayable game of all time. Oh my god, it might be the hardest game ever. You, you're, you're like, oh, teeny tiny little woman. And I'm just like, you're a behemoth. You're yeah. six foot five. I am. You're huge. You know, I'm even taller when I wear a hat. <laughs> um, <laughs> if we get you a good pair of heels, you're going to be unstoppable. Yeah. I was thinking about that, actually. I was thinking about getting shoes with lifts in them. I remember telling people about that in high school, and they were like, what the fuck do you mean you want shoes with what lifts? What a great way to do this, by the way. Yeah. Up. Breadcrumbs, man. It's an amazing system. And, like, you can't put it in any game. Like... There, there's the clairvoyance spell in Skyrim, and that kind of works. And they tried to do the same thing with Vans in um, Fallout 4, but it does not work the same. It's not as good at all. You have to spend a perk on it as well. It's crap. Um, but, like, clairvoyance is just really convenient. Right off the bat, huh? Right away. I could have got him. Is that Nicholas? Oh, it's our friend Temple again. I'm not sticking around in case whatever did it comes back. I'm heading for hydroponics to find Elizabeth. Schematic. The force gun. Oh, we got distracted from that. The force... So every gun in this is loosely applicable to a Resident Evil weapon. Line gun is your shotgun. Plasma cutter is your pistol. Do it with me. Whip, hmm. woo. Whip, woo. The Whip. little... The little... Hear the squeeze? Yeah, I do, I do like the... When you pick something up. Anyway, so, um... The contact beam and the force cannon I think you just picked up are similar to... Well, it's a big show! It's a big show! Sorry, I promised that I would do that. I don't know who I promised. I think it was just myself. Did he, fuck, did he like bounce one of your shots off of his arm blades? You got him. Last bolt in the chamber. That's good. How was that? Pretty good. Sorry, but yeah, I, I promised that I would sing uh, the Big Show song whenever we saw one of the fat necromorphs. 